Welcome everybody to another episode of Game of Thrones. We're back. In the last episode, Lord, what, whatever the fuck his name was, got stabbed in the throat. Fucking horrifying that was. Yeah, that's something you don't see every day. Somebody getting stabbed in the throat by the man that's sitting right in front of days, you. I feel. All right, let me shut up. The North Grove must never be lost. You're sending him to the wall. The of this house is in Lord Ethan's. Duncan, I've decided to name you as my sentinel. I'm just worried about my family. The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. Are you willing to risk an alliance with the crown? It's a risk I'm willing to take, Lord Tyrion. Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Asher. We don't want White Hill men within these walls. You can be my highborn ward. And yep. Uh, Ethan. Uh, I know it. No. Don't let them take me. Oh, my son. I wonder if there was a way to avoid that. Knowing Tall Tale, there's only one one way to do shit. Is this another character we're playing as? Ethan's off the list. Isn't that his brother right there? Is he pissing? Son of a bitch is pissing. Oh my god. Why are the graphics like that? Whoa, it's Jesus just me, Christ. Beska. <sighs> Took you long enough. Your ale's getting warm. Or warmer, I should say. Why are the graphics like that? They're they're weird. You can stop pacing. They'll be here soon. Um is that hookah? That is... <laughs> I was just kidding! Ale. It goes in yellow, comes out yellow, waste of time even drinking it, if you ask me. Considering we found it in an abandoned tavern, it's not bad. They smell off to you. It's the only thing in Yunkai that doesn't. I know. It's a filthy haven for thieves, murderers, and other deadly bastards. Hey, you nice. should feel right at home. I feel like the graphics I know I are do. a little bit weird. May we drink, thieve, and fight until the end. You're drunk, aren't you? Nah, I'm still sober because you're still ugly. <laughs> <laughs> God. Another round? Oh, if somebody asks me if I'm drunk, I'm gonna say no. Nah, I'm sober because you're still ugly. <laughs> Oh, Have you forgotten Christ. about our honored and exalted guest? Who? Go see if he's still breathing. Who? Oh my god. How's he doing? <laughs> we need him alive to collect his bounty. Kick him. No, oh, does Asher scare you? <laughs> you should see him when he's angry. <laughs> Eight hundred gold dragons for capturing him. Lucky we caught him trying to flee Yunkai. Lucky for us. Not so lucky for him. We should find more former slave masters with bounties on their heads. I don't need any more naked fat men in my life, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> they say only the poor know how to really spend money. We'll buy the finest wines, the best whores. Sleep in a bed with a- We reach the best whores when the bad ones are so much more fun. I knew I liked you for a reason. My point is, with enough coin, we could do anything. Go anywhere. I could afford passage back to Westeros. To Ironrath. I've heard nothing from my family in years. You mean go home? They treated you like shit there. 
kicked you out because you fell in love with a girl from the wrong damn house. Gwyn. A man doesn't choose who he loves. Your family should understand that. Westeros and its bloody houses. They're still who my family. Cares? They're still my family. My brothers and sisters. They had nothing to do with it. I suppose that's true. Just remember, we have a good thing here. And any moment now, we're gonna be rich. Let's make a toast. To all of us deadly bastards. To get in rich. To 800 gold dragons in our pocket. Well said. Oh god, I gotta press buttons at the right time, don't I? Beskar, I thought freed slaves put the bounty on Bazak. They did. With his own gold. So why are the fucking Lost Legion here? Oh, is that Tazal? From the Volantis job? Maybe he's forgotten about that. You! I told you if I saw you again! Tazal! Isn't it funny how life brings old friends together? Now cut your fucking throats! Good to see you too. Don't threaten me. It's good to see you, to see you too, Tazal. <laughs> Where is he? Where's who? Here. 400 dragons. They must be working for the Wise Masters. And that's all you're getting. It should be 800. The bounty is 800. You get four. It's more than you deserve. What the fuck? Give us 800 and you can have him. Don't be an asshole now. We're all sell swords here. We are nothing like you. The Lost Legion are the blood of all Valyria. And we are done taking orders from whimpering pigs. Damn, what he says. Oh my god! Bloody hell! And we're done with you, too. Don't talk to my men. You just made a huge mistake, Tazel. You two are going to be useful to me for once. It's not bloody likely. The wise masters. How oh, he wouldn't take less than 800 gold dragons. So he killed Bezak instead. Me? Luckily, we really? were there to deliver swift justice. So you steal the money yeah, and we accent. get the blame. What's up, Glenn? Ponte Osinas! Bojos me nomi jahoso kisikas! Flip table. Alright, who dies first? Who wants to dance at the end of my sword? Oh shit! Kill them! Now! God damn! No more life! Here's one! Ooh. Ooh. Come on! Damn! She couldn't pass me! What's up, dude? Who be thou? Hey, oh shit! Oh god! You owe me one. I'm right, I do. Oh god! Shit! Oh shit! Oh god! Ooh. This is for Volantis! Beska! <laughs> Fuck you, Asher. <laughs> oh my Tazal, god! Eat this! For brain! Still you born your s- ah! oh. <laughs> These motherfuckers are crazy! You know what this reminds me of? <laughs> that brothel in Norvos. What a way to go! Get your hand chopped off and shit. Break his neck, bust his knee. And the Lost Legion won't stop until uh, you and your friend are dead. Uh, bust knee. 
cool. Love that scream. God damn it! To Saul! Kill them both! Asha! I pressed it! Asha! Oh, it's you! Why all the gods of fire and fuck? <laughs> Who the fuck is he? My I uncle. Love dudes. To Zal? Fuck. Shit. More on their way. We need to go. I I pressed left. Oh, thanks. Come on. Is that the barrel that I pissed on? him. There was Damn. nothing in there. Yep. We have to keep moving. Malcolm, stop. Asher, I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. What are you doing here? Your brother Ethan sent me. I'm here to bring you home. What? I love this dude. He's funny. He's fucking... Holy hell. God. I gotta go pee. But I don't want to miss anything. What a fucking intro. That shit was amazing. I should have broke that motherfucker's neck. What the fuck did I click on? You clicked on brutality. He doesn't go kind. Killing, more killing. I want more actions. The Lost Lords, episode two. Ooh, it's a nice tune. Isn't that that dude from the first episode? That is that dude from the first episode. <laughs> Am I playing as that dude? He's still alive? Oh god. Oh lord. So uh, I'm playing as this dude. Man, the first episode he got fucking jacked. Hear you. So fucking far away. Daron, how you be? I be good. Father. gonna do that's far enough I come from the twins bearing the dead of house Forrester lordly tops from the looks of them all right we'll take them well they're not free are they how much are you paying for them Sir Royland you again I, 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 I was, got this time some poor I'm peasant all. dressed up like a lord, a stable boy was, in Bannerman's clothes. You did this and just Make day. noise. And you have the fucking stones to try it again. No, I... This house has suffered the loss of many good men. And you dare come here claiming to have Forest Lee. Now. Fine. I'll dump him in the river then. You come back here again, you won't Wave at him, wave at him. You got that? Wave at him. 
lousy sheep fucker. Come on, come on, sorry, come on. Sir. Right. Don't worry yourself. <laughs> Seven hours. What is it, sir? I'm alive, Which dumbass. Still alive? You there? Who are you? Give me a hand. Ryland. Roderick? Roderick! By oh, the gods, it is you! Sir? Fetch the maester! Hurry! Fetch the maester! I'm dying Roderick. here. I don't know how the fuck this dude's still alive. I saw him get murked. Oh god. Oh god. What are you doing with those? Are you cutting me open? I don't approve! <gasps> My lord, you should not be awake. The milk of a puppy. Drink. Calm now. Refuse. Don't be stubborn, my lord. <gasps> Roderick! My lady! No. I am at a very delicate moment in the surgery. Please, I want to see my son. Let him finish. Let him. <laughs> Sir, my lady, I must <gasps> insist that you leave. His legs are gone? Roderick, what have Say they what? done to you? These wounds would have killed any other man. As it is, I ain't never any other again. man. Roderick? Oh. Oh. He refused the milk of the poppy. Oh. That's Roderick for you. Brave as always. <laughs> but the pain must be... Oh. Roderick! Oh, boy. Roderick! Oh, boy. Who's humming this? What kind of fucked up hell am I going through now? I'm still wondering how the fuck is he alive? <sighs> Ooh. That's a beautiful song. I haven't heard that one before. It's nice. Roderick, thank the gods. Brother, I think oh, I lost oh. you. I'm sorry. I'm still I'm hurt sorry. though. I didn't mean to hurt you. Hugger. Call me your sister. Ah. How bad is it? Oh, it's pretty fucking bad. Maestro I saw this man get stabbed in the leg heal. and a horse fall on him. How he's and alive, who the hell knows. These wounds will heal. Will heal. These wounds will heal, Talia. I know. You'll be your old self before we know it. Killing people like never before. Patrick, there's something you need to know. Oh, God. Ethan is dead. Oh, my Ethan. God. Don't Bruce bring Bolton's it up. Bruce bastard came here and threatened to take me away. And then stabbed Ethan him in the throat. Me. And that monster put a blade through his throat. Yep. Like it was nothing. Ethan. How could this happen to him? We'll make Ramsay pay for what he did. I promise. Good. I'm going to chop his spine off, and while he's still alive, to I'm going to feed him to the wolves. The Ethan alongside father. And now mother wants me to write this song for the funeral. I can't. <laughs> you don't have to. You can do it. Maybe you don't have to. Then don't write it. Mother will understand. What's going on out there? It's been chaos here since he died. Ah, bet. We have White Hill soldiers stationed in our courtyard. Even the small folk don't feel safe. 
You need to show everyone who this house belongs to. They need a lot. You're still a hero to them. If you lead, Message others will follow. Retracted. I know you still need Stay time to heal, you. but... Be fine, Talia. Psychotic motherfucker. The council's meeting in the Great Hall right now, actually. Nobody expects you there, but if you think you're ready... Oh, I'm ready. I want to go. Can you even this stand? This is one badass son of a bitch. I guess we'll see. How he's still alive, who the fuck knows? And gets up right after a surgery. I missed you, brother. Oh my lord. Somebody coming you in? You can do this, Roderick. Come on, get up. I know you can. Come on, come on, come on. I thought his arm was gone for a second there. How the fuck is he standing? Ooh, Roderick. never mind. Grab the wooden sword. I'm fine. Use as a cane. Why'd you do that? I won't let anyone see you like this. Not when the house They've appears already so weak me. already. I don't care. I need to go. I need to attend that meeting. And you will. But you will get there on your feet. It's a long way to the Great Hall. Give me something we to can't use risk as a you falling where others can see. Take my hand. Let me help you. Thank you. I'm not gonna reject Thank help. Thank you, Talia. Even with a motherfucker like this, no. Ready? Son of a bitch must be dying. That's it. He's gonna fall, he's gonna fall, isn't he? Use something as Everyone a will be king. so glad to see you up. Though, I think you'll find that much has changed. Much... indeed. How much... He is part of the... Maki army can survive anything. You forget your place, madam. Castle Black. So this is the seat of the Night's Watch. The wall. Always wanted to see it, but not like this. Recruits at the gate! That was a big ass motherfucker, and, and it was just a horse. You arrival, is it? Another one for Frostfinger. On a horse, Frostfinger. They're yeah. talking about me. Trouble's brewing. Bitch. No. Yes. Looks like it was built by giants, doesn't it? Huge. You're new, here to take the black. Hmm. Because you got that look about you. Aye, I am. Thought so. <laughs> I'm new here myself. Frostfinger. He's the one you want. Handles all new recruits. Where Which one's Frostfinger? Frost that grizzled old prune over there. Says us new recruits are all dead men. But don't let him scare you. <laughs> That's just his way. You seem nice. That's not so good round here. 
Oh, tough one out. I tra I change between things. I can be nice whenever I want. I can be fucking a dick whenever I want. Listen, don't fuck with me. I won't fuck with you, you creepy ass son of a bitch. Your Frostfinger. You recruits. You come. You train. You fight. You die. That's how I usually end up. Who are you, boy? I'm Garrett Tuttle. I'm Garrett Tuttle, nephew to Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of Ironrath. Garrett Tuttle of Ironrath. And how does a Castellan's nephew get himself sent to the wall? You a thief? A raper? You abandon your post? Or do you just fancy dying someplace cold? I, I killed, killed a man, man who murdered my family. Then you know how to fight, at least. And you're no liar, either. Yeah. Sir? From Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of House Forester. My uncle wrote to the Night's Watch. He goes on for a bit, but then he asks us to make you a ranger. As if it's a knighthood. So you see, Tuttle, I know all about you. You are a killer. Even if you are man enough to own up to it. You don't know me. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Now then, we'll start your training in the morning. For today, you need a cot and a cloak. Understood. I like that dude. Oh, and Tuttle. Sooner or later, the Night's Watch will be your death. When it comes, try to make it quick. <laughs> oh, I like this guy. He's the kind of person that would stab you in the back. Switching characters again. In last we'd heard, Asher was in Slaver's Bay. So, Malcolm caught a ship headed for... I heard they took him off a corpse cart. <laughs> and he's missing his arms and legs. <laughs> At least he can still eat his shit. The White Hill soldiers are drunk again. <laughs> and we have too few men to handle them. Ooh, I'm going to fucking murder them. Let's just get to the Great Hall. Um, why does it start me here? Well, I, brewing, I, I know he's it. dead. And they've dressed up some peasant in his place. Fill me up, would you? And bring you some salted pork while you're at it. They're all <laughs> looking yourself at me. Up, you lazy fuck. Is that him? Yeah. Has to be, doesn't it? He's hideous. <laughs> Had a run-in with Walder Frey, did you? And he's leaning on a girl. Should have buried him with the corpses. I'm going to stab Forest all of them. Real about your leg, oh, give us a toss. Don't let go of your sister now. Ooh, I can't wait until I murder all of you. Which one of them is gonna push me down? This one, I bet. We have business in the Great Hall. <laughs> Go round. Move aside, soldier. Move aside, soldier. I'm quite comfortable, thank you. And I don't think you're gonna make me. Give me a goddamn knife. I wonder what's weaker. Your legs? Or this house? Move! Now! You gonna move? Or we're gonna have to get ugly here? Go on then, my lord. <sighs> I 
I scared the fuck out of that dude. Let's go. I leaned up straight and I screamed at his face and holy hell he got fucking scared. It's ridiculous. You're treating them like the wine guests. keeps their wits dull. It makes us look weak. Both of you, please. So you'd rather they riot? Duncan, you're a damn fool sometimes. It doesn't matter what you think. I was chosen as sentinel. My lord. Damn. Hey, what's up, guys? Nothing new over here. Just dying. Roderick. My boy. Come, join us. I don't Lady know how Talia, I'm still standing. You should have told us the Lord needed help. It would have taken too long. Besides, I scared the shit out of a man. It's good. <clears throat> it's good to see you awake, Lord Roderick. We didn't expect you so soon. The Maester said it would be weeks before you were walking. If you walked again at all. It was highly probable. I told you he'd be up and about. I'm not here to talk about my elf. Perhaps we should get started. Yes, let's. Dahlia's told me the state of our house. Then you know our situation is grim, my lord. No thanks to your sentinel. He's been getting the White Hill soldiers drunk. It keeps them off their guard. They think you're a bloody fool. My lord, please. Oh, oh, I'm a fool. At least I was there by Ethan's side when Ramsey stole them. I've told you, I was keeping an eye on the Bolton soldiers. You should have been protecting your lord. Now Ethan's dead, and Ryan a hostage. And what Slap you your fist down. Get him back? Nothing. Shut the fuck up. I am your lord. Of course. Apologies, my lord. The White Hills have my brother. We fight amongst ourselves, when we should be fighting them. We'd need an army to win that fight. And we don't have one. I'll summon your allies. Not do whatever it takes. Then get me. Then an find army. me one, Sir Royal. That's no simple command, my lord. Most of our men fled after Lord Ethan was killed. And our allies are either dead or too afraid of the Boltons to help us. God damn. You forget the Glenmores. Who? You'd be wed to Elena Glenmore already, if not for the war. And her father is no coward. Now that you've returned, the marriage can proceed as planned. The marriage? Well, uh, much has changed. The Glenmores may no longer desire the union. Lady Elena will decide for herself. Your betrothed is on her way here as we speak. Lady Elena? She's coming now? Betrothed is coming to Ayra. Yes, my son. A raven arrived this morning. Lady Elena is eager to see you. If she still wishes to marry, we'd have the allies we so desperately need. Their army would become oath-bound to Roderick. And we could burn High Point to the fucking ground. Yes, this marriage could be our chance. Of course, we Isn't must hope Lady Elena still wants to marry Roderick. We're talking about a marriage, not an Ironwood contract. Talia does have a point. I'm not the man I used to be. You can still make her. I'm an happy, ugly fuck. Patrick, and she can do the same for you. If Elena does come to Ironrath, she'll see those soldiers in the courtyard. We starve them out, and they'll have to leave. I'd rather they be lying around drunk than setting the stables on fire. My lord, perhaps you could put an end to this tiresome uh, dispute. Keep, uh, keep, keep them, them drunk. drunk. It's better than inciting them to violence. Yes, my lord. If we no, starve them, that's gonna cause a riot upon them. If we keep them drunk, they're gonna let their guard down. Maester, it's time to light the ironwood torches. Yes, my lady. I gotta pee Welcome so back, bad. It's got to be back. It's amazing to be back. We know I'm dying. Ooh, blue fire. Gregor last lit these torches when his mother passed. Ironwood doesn't burn easily, he told me. But foresters have a way. And now we light them for him. And Ethan. How is your song coming? Ethan always helped me with music. It's not the same without him. 
You must stay strong. You have to be strong, Talia. Everyone knows how much Ethan meant to you. I'm sure it will honor him well. What about that, that, that kid that got taken? About Elena, I've sent a letter to Mira. The Tyrells hold much influence over the Glenmores. I don't know where things stand between her and Lady Marjorie, but maybe your sister can find a way to help. Hmm. Maybe. Perhaps. Just realized that's them in that portrait. Join your characters again. Who is this? Lena. It's entirely or ridiculous. Mira. If it's not the flowers, it's the food or the table settings. I'll be back, guys. Hold on. All right, let's continue. I have to go pee right quick. Is that the letter to the orphanage? Yes, my lady. Yes. It's nearly done. Make sure to tell them we'll send all the leftovers. And mm, something nice after that. We will make a large donation. I hope to visit soon. You and the children are ever in our thoughts. A lovely sentiment, Mira. I guess that one I didn't even read it. And the seal. Here you are. That was a cruddy transaction. Oh, are there any more invitations to send, or are we finally done with the cursed things? One more. An invitation to Sir Maynard. Ah, yes. One of my father's favorite drinking companions. I don't know when chaos is gonna go down. I have a letter for Lady Mira Forrester. So Thank you. Dude. My pleasure, Lady Mira. What is it, Mira? Stuff. It's from my mother. She asks that I help ensure Roderick's betrothal to Elena Glenmore remain intact. How can you do that from a thousand leagues away? Who the fuck knows? Uh, it's my help she's after, isn't it? She's a bold woman. Most would shy away from asking such things. Forgive my mother. She doesn't see the harm in what she does. She's not entirely wrong. A letter from me could encourage the Glenmores to honor the betrothal. But it wouldn't be very discreet you'd be forcing their hand. That isn't the way I do things. You pushed me before and you saw the results. I'm sure your brother can secure the marriage on his own. I'd better get going. Mira, we'll talk more later. I still don't understand what the fuck is going on in this fucking game. Don't write your own note. Don't write your own note. Please, God, don't write your own note. If Lady Marjorie wrote a letter. Finish letter to Sorm. Forge a Just finish the letter. I'm sorry, Roderick. Sir Maynard, you are hereby invited. Mira, Lady Marjorie sent me to pick up the letters. Sir Maynard. <sighs> 
The man's breath smells like a brew house. I was hoping I'd catch you at something slightly more exciting. A love letter, perhaps? Or a declaration of war? I know you're very busy with Lady Marjorie and... and all that's happening with your family. But I was hoping we could talk. About what? If you don't mind. Go, Go ahead. ahead, then. Well, it's... We really should get these letters sent first. Do you need any help with those? I've got them. Damn. Switching characters. I wish there was a symbol on the tree saying so find what character you would switch to. Bloody cold today, isn't it? Seems oh, it's to keep getting colder. Seems like it's always fucking cold. It, it is snow. Oh god. Oi, fuckhead. New here. But you're in my spot. Norm. Um Okay, I was it was fucking answer. Most of you will be dead within the year. <sighs> Frostfinger and his bloody speeches. If you want to survive in the night's watch, listen close. You know why I got sent to the wall? The why? wall was erected over eight thousand years ago to defend the At this girl I used to fuck now and again. Face like a queen, tits like a whore. Turned out she was married to some lordling. He tried to stick me with this. Ooh. I was stuck in him instead. So next time I say move, you'd best fucking move. Shut up for once, will you? What's your problem? I'm sick of Finn bragging about all the girls he's fucked. And what dire crime are you here for? Fucking potatoes. Potatoes? <laughs> you fuck potatoes. <laughs> yeah. Fuck potatoes. What? No! I stole them. That's what got me sent to the wall. Nobody cares, thief. Don't call me that. My name's Cutter. Cutter the potato fucker. There's one for the songs. Oi, my sister was hungry. I've got something for your sister. You can talk about my sister, all right? Will you stop arguing? Who in seven hells is talking back there? Oh God! Oh. Who was it? It was my Sorry, fault, sir. It was my fault. Covering for your new brothers already, are you? Yeah. Garrett Tuttle here wants to be a ranger, so we can go north of the wall and die on some wildling spear. But what he wants doesn't mean shit. Oh. So today you're all gonna show me what you're made of. Can you swing a sword? Shoot a bow? Are you strong? I regret what Those I said about that guy. Well I wanna stab him. Might just survive. The rest of you. All right. In hell. Frostfinger. Who the fuck is that? Word. Go on. Get started. So who am I fighting here? I I wanted Best to of luck, Tuttle. I wanted to stick up for the for the potato fucker, not that big fucking asshole. No! No! Wow! Just, wow! Here we go. <laughs> Again. Oh! Do I get to choose one? Come to eat your brains for breakfast. No. Do I get to choose what I do? Horse pet. <laughs> Demonstrate your combat skills. Uh, no, no, no! God damn it, I don't want a crossbow. Have these where I. Ooh! <laughs> Man's Raider will shit himself when he sees you coming. <laughs> Let me show you. Lucky. 
All right, let's see if you can aim worth a wildling's arse. Right. Shoot the targets I tell you to. Let's okay. start easy. Middle dummy, center of the chest. Middle dummy, center of the chest. Oh, God! You can follow orders at least. Next bolt. Left target, head. Left target, head. Good. Right target, chest. Right target, chest. Not bad. Center, between the eyes. One less wildling. You hit all of them. Nicely done. Finn thinks he's so bloody clever. If a real wildling got his hands on him, ah, he's just a bully. Aye, he is. That's why I took this. Swiped it right off him. Don't tell, all right? I don't think he'd take it kindly. I won't tell anyone. I knew I could trust you. Sorry about that. Am I still, am I still, am I still good? Yeah, I'm good. All right. I got seven coins. All right, can I sword to sword fucking combat now? Take that! Take that, you whore! Watch your bloody tongue. You, grab a practice sword. Which one is a fucking practice sword? Uh, I'm guessing that's a. I'm guessing this, this is the practice sword. Oh no, it's a regular swords. I'll be sparring with you today. Remember, these blades are dull. Sorry about that. But a sword's still a sword. Good luck. Oh, God. Come on, keep at it. Oh, boy. Stop. I'm pressing the man. God. Hey, what's up? You lose. Well, four. Yeah. Smirk. Get off me, you bloody ox. You got lucky. It's not luck. It's just God's skill. I said, hit the chest, not the bloody wall. <laughs> Lift. You there, recruit. Scrawny, aren't you? Scrawny. See if you can carry one of these barrels over to the winch. All right. Seems so What's in it? It's pitch. Dump it off the wall, and it'll burn the wildlings down to their fucking bones. Right. I can do this. Want some help? <laughs> oh, you're a fucking douche.
Come on. Where am I bringing this to? Not near fucking fire. Don't drop it, don't drop it. You dick. Don't hurt yourself, Tuttle. Oh, I'm going to stab you. Like a fucking pig. I'm thinking steward for you. You can help Frostfinger wash his cock. If the thing hasn't frozen off. Fuck off! Fuck off, Finn. Bloody ass. Mind your language, Garrett. Is he smirking? You don't want to fuck with me, you whore. You're pathetic. Fuck off. You didn't even try. A crossbow's a coward's weapon. Besides, I could hit that dummy from here with my... Where is it? Where the fuck's my knife? If someone has it, I'll cut their fucking balls off. How the fuck should I know? You were the last one I showed it to. Well, you and... It was you. What? You little fucking thief. It weren't me. Finn, don't. I'm going to stab you. Give me my knife. I don't have it, I swear. Out of my way. Get the fuck out of here. What the fuck. What's up? How's it going? You wanna deal with me? Ooh. Hey, look. Fight. Fight. Yeah, get here it. they go again. Oh shit! Where are you going, boy? Where are you going? Come on, hit him! Oh! Get off! What is going on here? He stole my fucking knife! No, I didn't. And Garrett defended him. The last thief I caught no longer has hands. I swear I don't have it. He must have hid it. <laughs> and you? I expected better, Tuttle. Oh, good. Uh, you go Instead, fuck off, Instead, I too. find you doing this on your first bloody day of training. Sir, Not I... Not another word. You clearly need a few days scrubbing the latrines. Frostfinger, I need another man atop the wall. Fine. Let him freeze his balls off. I'll deal with this one. Get off! Oh! Find your fucking manners. You. Damn! Come with me. God damn! What the f- Dude! That... I love that potato fucker. Oh my lord. Ah, why did I have to switch? That was a fucking epic battle, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. I love King's Landing in the afternoon. The sun just barely kisses your skin. You used to love this place. Remember, we'd come listen to the musicians in the evening with Lady Marjorie. That was a You're fucking right. awesome it's beautiful fight. Here. Just through here. Now you know what, what the gas doing? mass society can do. You'll see. Queen Cersei's finest wine. Are you serious? Ah, uh, is there enough for two? I hope you've got another one of those. <laughs> I never took you for a lush mirror. <sighs> Sadly, it's just the one. Zam, get the fuck back that smack, though. A little won't hurt. It's just wine. Ah, yeah, take a drink. Fuck it. Get caught, get caught. Who gives a shit? <sighs> so, 
I, uh... wonder if it's poison. You gonna get drunk? Well, I just... Just I'm say what you need to say! Listen, if I tell you this, Mira, you must promise to keep it to yourself. Right. You can tell no one. I want to trust you, but I need you to promise. You know who I really, am? Really, Mira, you could no. say something. Just please, keep it a secret. What you gotta say? My mother was a handmaiden to Lady Elena for many years. Really? She became pregnant. It was a disgrace to her family. My true name is Sarah. Flowers. You're a bastard? Yes. <laughs> I'm Why did you gotta to say it like that, I though? I know that, but to always have to hide. Was your mother from a noble house? I'm she must have been. Oh my God, she served Lady Elena. Yes, though it's not well known. Distant cousins of the Tyrells, I'm told. They wanted nothing to do with me after my mother died. After what? How, oh my! Oh my God! How did you get so far? How did you get this far? I, I mean, I've why been not? Very lucky, I suppose. It's just, I don't want to be Sarah Flowers forever. I need Lady Marjorie to arrange a marriage for me. It's my chance at a life. Who do you wish a to marry? A family of my own. Did you have someone in mind? Someone you'd wish to marry? I'd have to convince Lady Marjorie to make an introduction first. I know she often confides in you, and I was hoping that maybe... Okay, bye. Sometime when she comes to you wanting to talk, you might... Suggest she talk to me instead. Give me a chance to win her over. Coming from you is sure will. to mean a lot. Of course, Sarah. Thank you, Mira. Thank you. What I'm from? so sorry. Here I am talking about myself. I know your family's troubles are much greater than mine. With what happened to your brother, <laughs> your father. It's hilarious how she said it. You're a bastard? You need this more than I do. Keep it. Hmm. A conspiracy of handmaidens. Lord Tyrion. My lord. Ladies. What have we here? If you mean to drink from that flagon, you're going about it the wrong way. Care to join us, Lord Tyrion? Hmm. Not the finest arbor red, but a favorite of my sister's. Quite expensive for a handmaiden. I'd be curious to know how you got hold of it. Since I'm certain my sister didn't give it to you, she uh, won't even share with me. I took the wine from the cellars. Aren't you full of surprises? I suggest bringing cups next time. There are risks worth taking. Stealing wine from the Queen Regent isn't one of them. Especially if you wish to have an alliance with me. Things have changed. My father has recently taken an interest in Ironwood. Most of the Royal Navy went up in green flames. It must be rebuilt. He insisted I handle things myself. I'm on my way to meet representatives of Lord Whitehill. Lord Whitehill? He's hired a pair of merchant lords to broker for his house. It would seem Lord Whitehill wishes to sell the ironwood right out from beneath your family. I don't know much about the man, but judging by his up-jumped swords, I will speak for House Forrester. Perhaps you could. Come with me. These men think I have no choice but to deal with them. Imagine their surprise when I bring a forester to the table. It might be the first fun I've had in months. Oh, God. 
my lady. I'm going to die. You're drinking more. Don't get drunk now. We've been waiting here for an hour. Andros, be courteous. Courtesy in a merchant. Like finding gold in your chamber pot. Hello. Apologies, my lady. Who is this? Some girl you've brought for entertainment. My name is Mira Forrester. Yeah, your surprise on your face is pretty big, isn't it? Mira Forrester? Why are you here? A fair question. We were told we would be speaking to Lord Tyrion alone. This is no place for a forester. I'm here to sell our ironwood, my lord. Oh, really? Andros? I'm sorry, Lady Mira, but we've already spoken to Lord you Tyrion. You spoke, I listened. Lady Mira has since persuaded me to consider her offer first. Where are you going? Now, if you'll excuse us. You're going to dismiss You us? can't do this. I assure you, I can. This is a mistake, my lord. I don't think so. Ooh. Lord Whitehill will hear of this. Oh, well. He's not a man to take such matters lightly. Nor am I. That's enough, Andros. Stare him down. <laughs> he dislikes your silence. Lord Tyrion. Lord Tyrion, do let me know when you've come to a decision. I'd like the opportunity to change your mind. Lady Mira. Good day, gentlemen. Ah, well. I shouldn't have stared him fun. down. Now, as He's for your offer, down. what did you have in mind? My lord? The crown's ironwood. I assume you have a proposition? Kind of. You had a reason for coming here. I know it wasn't just to entertain me. Help me stop the White Hills. Help me stop the White Hills. Well, the quickest way to strangle your enemy is with his own purse strings. Say the Crown agrees to buy Ironwood solely from you. Lord Whitehill will be left in the cold. If he wishes to sell to the Crown, he'll have to do so through your family. You will have him at your mercy. Hmm. Or you'll bring your houses to open war. Oh. Oh, God. You do know that's a possibility, don't you? I'm with you at your, our side. With you as a partner, that won't happen. As Master of Coin, I can do many things. But sending an army to the north is not one of them. However, I know your house needs this. I'll consider the arrangement. Oh, thank God. Of course, you'd have to do something for me in return. And that may be... Don't worry. The terms will be fair. I'll do anything. Whatever it is, Except I'll do it. do anything in a program. I just asked you for an open favor, and you agreed as if I were inviting you to tea. You're either very brave or very foolish. I'm both. We have an understanding, then. Thank you, my lord. This will either be very good for both of us, or very bad for you. For your sake, I hope it's the former. I already seen somebody get stabbed in the throat. This is nothing new. Getting murdered in battle is nothing. Yep, switch characters, I know it. Oh, I'm Asher. Oh, I'm all fucking bloody. Or let's sneak around this corner. Should look at it. Oh. They were headed for the main gate. I know another way. You coming with us then? If you're to save your house, you'll need more than the two of us at your side. You'll need an army. That's why you're here, isn't it? To hire one. 
An army of cell sorts. And a man to lead them. Do you hear what I'm saying, boy? Beska can lead them. What? She's stronger than most knights in Westeros. This is your fight, Asher. Your family. None of that matters without sellswords to hire. And all the companies around here are engaged. What about Croft? One-eyed Croft, with the second sons. They're all with the Targaryen girl now. <laughs> but Croft owes me a favor. I'm pretty sure he hates you, actually. No. Nah. He'll help us. Why? I'll make sure of it. There and how are, are you going to do that? People hiding. And there's. He some... didn't part on the best of terms. I'll be charming. I'll, I'll convince him. him. Maybe with my knee to his balls. <laughs> there are other ways, Asher. Not half as effective, though. Speaking of worried of Malcolm, there are well, worrisome times. This mother of dragons and her cell swords are headed north, so we make for Marine. Wait, Marine? Shit. What? Unfinished business there. I don't want to talk about it. We can't afford any distractions. It's not your problem. Trouble's fucking broke. It'll be fine. I trust you. It's fine. I trust you, Beska. I shouldn't have said anything. I said I was with you, little brother. And I meant it. Oh, there we go. Ponte Renas! Don't guy who no Josi but Dagon Costotti Daor. Oh god, guards coming. Ooh. Oh, we got a guard coming. Don't. 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 Just one more we'll have to kill later. Let's go. You did well back there, Asher. You acted like a true leader. Then we'll kill him later. You two can talk about it later. We need to get out of here. They won't stop looking for us. Get stabbed. It's a long journey to Marine on foot. I hope you're you ready, bring? Asher. It won't be easy. Let's just get that army. I'm ready. Good lad. Either we cross the narrow sea with an army at our backs, or House Forrester will not survive to see winter. So this guy doesn't know about his brother's death. Oh god. I can only imagine what he finds out. You switch characters too much in this damn game. What was that? I don't trust this. Is that my house? Turn back, bitch. Turn back! You... Stupid! Peek open, bust in. Moira! Oh god. What's happened here? Uh, let me check out that note that was on the bed. Read. Something's happened. Come on. I have information that will aid you with the imp. Meet me in the gardens at midnight. I don't trust that at all. I don't trust anything in this game. Am I switching characters again? Oh, god damn it. Ooh, 
Blue there. <clears throat> that should last through Lady Elena's visit, at least. There's been no news from Mira. She may not have found a way to help with Elena. We'll be fine, Mother. I pray you're right. Lord Glenmore's army could keep us from ruin. But Elena must still agree to the marriage. <clears throat> My lord, you might remind Lady Elena that in terms of lineage, you are still very much a man. Maester. What I mean is, if the two of you wanted to produce an heir, it should not be a concern. Gross in question. Of, of course not. I just meant... Enough, Maester. When last we spoke of Elena, you seemed unsure how she might feel about you. You just have to show her that you're still the man she knew. I don't mean to burden you with unwanted advice. Thank you, Mother. This advice well taken. I'm just so glad to see you home. My lord, she's here. I regret making my choice about the guards being drunk. Roderick? But it was the best, the best choice. You look... I know, I'm You're handsome. Really... I know, I'm unspeakably handsome. I see you haven't lost your sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> no. Just two limbs and half a face. <laughs> Please. Charm her. So, here we are. I'm glad to see you up and about. You look as beautiful as ever, Elena. Oh, thank you. I set out for Ironrath as soon as I heard you were alive. My father suggested I wait, but I can't believe it's been two years. Your brother's name day feast. We danced until the sun came out. You're charming the but pants now your off. house prepares for a funeral. And you... Tell me the truth, Roderick. How are you, really? And please, be honest with me. I don't mean to pry, but... I want to know what you're going through. Honestly, I feel fine. May not look pretty, but... I'm still myself. I'm sure it's worse than that. I know you too well. So much has changed since we were children. Playing hide-and-seek in the grove and... You're so easy to find. You always hid behind the same tree. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I wanted you to find me. You are charming the pants off. But Roderick... I, um... I need to ask you something. When I arrived at Ironrath today, your courtyard was filled with drunken soldiers. White Hill soldiers. They said... Some terrible things. The White Hills are your oldest enemies, Roderick. Why are they here? Has something happened? Trust me. They won't be here long. That wasn't an answer. Ah, uh, she doubts me. Fuck. I thought there was going to be a be choice. Honest with you, Roderick. I have always looked brother. forward to our marriage. But in light of all that's happened to your family, I... My father is questioning the wisdom of our betrothal. He wants me to call it off. Your father is a coward. And what do you want? You can't let that happen. We can't let him do that to us. I'm not powerless here, Roderick. If I told him I thought this marriage was wise, he'd listen. And frankly, I'm torn. Don't care about your scars, Roderick. I love the boy you were, and I can love the man you are. <laughs> but my family can't get drawn into a war with the Boltons. They're the Wardens of the North. And they flay their enemies. I know things may look bad, but I won't let our houses fall. <sighs> I wish I could stand by you, Roderick, but I have to be practical. Lena. It doesn't matter how we feel. How can I ask my father to risk everything? I can pay him. 
Because Even I for love you. you. Because I love you, Elena. Roderick. I wish that was enough. I'm sorry. But I have to think of my family. I'm going to tell Father the betrothal is off. If it helps, we can delay the announcement. It'll give you time to get your affairs in order. Deepest apologies, my lord. I tried to stop him, but so, he... So, the rumors are true. Oh, God. You have no right to just... And if it isn't Elena Glenmore... You're not still marrying into this wretched family. My father has not yet made a decision. Well, for what it's worth, you can do much better than this cripple. And my son Griff needs a bride. Get out. Now. How rude of you. Your mother's the one who invited me here. That's not true. I sent a raven to Lord Whitehill about letting Brian attend the funeral. But I never expected him to barge in like this. Oh, she practically begged me to come. Of course, I'd want the same in her position. The youngest son hung to mourn his dead father and brother. If you've hurt Ryan in any way... Spare me the threats, Roderick. He's fine. I just want to be certain that you know your place. Lord Ramsay ordered your family to obey my soldiers until my son Griff arrives from Harrenhal. But now I hear you're ordering them around and keeping them dull on wine. It makes me start to question your obedience. Lud, enough of this. Let's talk this Fine. through. Let's talk this through. How about I talk and you fucking listen? How about I kick your ass? Sure. And you die. Here's the idea. We're going to make a fresh start, you and I. Your brother Ethan called me Craven. But you're a different man entirely, aren't you? No. So, if you want Ryan at that funeral, show Lady Elena you respect your betters. Kneel, and kiss my shiny ring. Just do it, Roderick. You don't want to end up like your brother, do you? Please. It means nothing, and we'll get to see Ryan again. Go on. Get on your knees. Fuck that! I'm not kissing your ring. Do what you must. Fine. I'll just tell Ryan you didn't want to see him. No, please. And because of your defiance... I'm taking what should have been mine in the first place. The other half of the Ironwood Forest. You can't Ramsay do that! Ramsay Snow I know said... what Ramsay said. I'm saying something else. As of today, I harvest Ironwood from wherever the fuck I please. And you can't do a bloody thing to stop me. I'm glad you're starting to see things my way. Well, I have what I came for. I'll leave you to your business. I'm going to kill you. Rip your head off. And Ooh, shove it up your ass. Way, my men have a name for you. Roderick the Ruined. <laughs> Isn't that clever? I'm going to chop his head off and I'm going to shove it up his ass. He's always been a brute. I'm just glad you didn't submit to him. You'd put your pride ahead of your family. What's poor Ryan going to think? I couldn't kiss his that we've ring. we've abandoned him. I won't bow to Lord Whitehill. And now your brother will pay the price. Did I do good? My lord, are you well? I'm going to kill that man. Yeah! I knew it was gonna cut out. Fucking awesome. And it's true, I am going to kill that man. You 
can't be fighting with the other recruits. You need those men to have your back. There's enough out here trying to kill us without trouble amongst our own. I had to fight back. Finn's a bully. Couldn't just let him push me around. Fight every bully at Castle Black and that's all you'll ever do. I'm Garrett. Crossfinger told me about you. Seems to think you might be trouble. He's not wrong. You might be right. You might be right. He said worse about me. I'm going to murder that he man. Said you fought for the north that with the foresters. Son of a bitch. You were there. At the twins. Yes. I still don't understand. Three thousand men, and not one could save my brother. Why didn't anyone fight back? Why didn't they rally to their king? The men were too drunk to draw their swords. The fray's cut us open. Those cowards. Couldn't face Rob like men, so they stabbed him in the back. They couldn't even give him an honorable death. Let him die fighting. Walder Frey and Roose Bolton will pay for their treachery. I'd like to believe you, but men like that don't get what they deserve. Oh, it's now the happen. Freys command River Run, and the Boltons are wardens of the North. After what they did, it's not right. They murdered my family. I should have been there. What? Wait a minute, I just skipped the dialogue entirely. I it's, keep thinking if I'd been there, He was supposed there, to say they killed my something. family, sister, and father. But chances are, I'd be dead. I saw that in the subtitles. Whatever I once thought, my place is here. With the night's watch. I feel like something's going to happen. What's going to happen? It is fucking cold as shit in this room. One day it's hot, one day it's fucking cold. This room can't decide. There are those here who will hate you for who you are. Southerners who will call you traitor. Northerners who will call you craven. Some won't even have a reason. They'll hate you anyway. You can't do anything about it. Craven is. Trust me, I know. I don't care if they hate me. Let them think what they like. Ignoring them won't be as easy as you think. Most of the men are criminals, forced to take the black. You were a squire for a noble house. What happened to you today happened to me more times than I can count. I learned there's nothing more important than having brothers you trust. <sighs> but just, oh my God, that is beautiful. Oh, I'm walking here. I'm walking here. I felt the same first time I saw it. I heard you want to be a ranger. Why? Why risk your life out there? Protect I want to protect House Forrester. You'll protect them by doing your duty here. Not many recruits want to be rangers. They'd rather stay here, where they think they'll be warm and safe. But Mance Raider marches on the wall with a hundred thousand wildlings. I've seen them for myself. The men here are murderers. Thieves, rapers. You won't like most of them, and they won't like you. But they're your brothers now. Can you stand with them? Can you see past your differences? I'll stand with them. Glad to hear it. I'd say you'll get used to the cold, but you won't. <laughs> Come on. Better get by a fire, or you'll end up like Frostfinger. Character switch? Character switch. Who are we switching to? Yep.
this here was a bad idea. I'm here, but where are you? Oh, this was a bad, bad idea. Oh, God. <gasps> this, this girl's gonna die. She's gonna die. I've come to terms with it. You stupid fucking birds! Who is that? Where do you oh. think you're going? At this time of night? I, I was just headed back to my room. It's a little late to be out, isn't it? Do you know what this uniform means? It means you serve the Lannisters. So, you best get yourself back to your chambers. And I mean, now. If you don't like it, you can take it up with the commander. No. I'm uh, saying shit, that Are you deaf? At ease, Lucan. The lady is with me. Yes, sir. Damn, you Enjoy rough son night. of a bitch. Dick. I hope he wasn't bothering you, my lady. I'm Damien. Did you write the note? You were in the throne room earlier. Did you leave me this note? I did. I want to trust very you, but you I don't. It. I don't trust anybody. I've been wanting to talk to you for quite some time. Why all the secrecy? If you wanted to talk to me, you could have asked. It never seemed the right time. I am sorry about this, Mira. But you've made enemies of the wrong people. A handmaiden should know her place. What? What are you talking about? I'll make this quick if that helps. What the- I'd hate to see you suffer. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking- <gasps> I can't let you kill that man. Fuck you. Fuck you too. I'd made enemies. He said I'd angered the wrong people. So someone sent him? What are you doing here? I heard yelling. You did what you had to do, Lady Mira. I kind of let him choice. kill you. I need to get back. Someone might see me. I'll take care of you. I know a few places in Fugle. No one will ever find him. Good. Say nothing. Don't tell anyone. Good luck. And be careful. Thanks. The knife! Everything alright, sir? <gasps> Damien! Where are ya? The knife! Keep the knife. Keep it. Ah, shit! Keep it. Fuck tossing the knife. I need protection at this point. I told you I couldn't trust him. I said I trust you, but at the same time, I can't trust anybody. Oh, my lord.
Watch them come into this funeral and murder me. What's Gwyn Whitehill doing here? No idea. Hello, Roderick. Sir Ryland. It's been a while since we've met. Yes. Last time I saw you, you and my brother had almost started a war. Your father wanted to murder Asher for your little love affair, remember? That was a long time ago. May we speak privately? My lady? How much more death is going to happen? I came here because... I know how hard these past few days must have been for you and your family. He... they killed my, my father! probably mean nothing to you. Thank you, Gwyn. I'm so sorry, Roderick. Your brother didn't deserve this. Yet, Neither of them did. Yet they murdered him. Listen. I know the hostage. But I think you deserve some news of him. I know it's little consolation. But if I can offer you this... So you have news of Ryan? Yes. He's well. Not happy, but... Just know your brother is safe at High Point. I'm looking after him, but... What? The other day he said something that made me worry. He asked me if his father died because he was a coward. He asked if he was really a thief and a traitor like my father says. I don't wish to upset you, but... I thought you should know. Please help him, Gwyn. Don't let him believe what your father tells him. I've been doing my best to set him right, but he is only a child. He feels forgotten. Alone. He's waiting for his family, but every day my father tells him they will never come. That they've chosen their pride over him. Tell him to and stay with strong. each passing day, those words start to sound like truth. Tell him to stay strong. Have him repeat our house words every day until I come for him. Of course. But if you truly want to bring Ryan home, this war has to end. You know that. We don't have to be enemies, Roderick. Hello, Gwyn. It's good to see you, Talia. I hope I can count on your discretion. Roderick, you should speak to Mother. I'm going to chop that fat bastard's head off and shove it up Mother. his ass. Come join the others. He should be here. He should be with his family. But instead, they send her. Gwyn may us. be able to help us. It's happening all over again. I can see it. My father's house was once mighty like this one. But his loyalty to the Targaryens cost us dearly. I watched as countless of our kin fell. Saw our lands destroyed. Everything we clung to was ripped from our hands. I can't watch that same fate before this family. Our house. My children. Our family is strong, Mother. We will not fall. Many men are strong, and still the night takes them. You must be ready to defend us, Roderick. Your body may be damaged, but your spirit must be like iron. You let like nothing stand in your way, like do you diamond. understand? If you have to murder every last White Hill down to the babes in their beds, no matter what, you must do it. Promise me. I will kill anyone who stands in my way. I will do whatever it takes. Get Remember stabs that. in the back. You must be ready. Promise me. We will be ready, Mother. Mira, Asher, even Garrett. They all stand with us. We are strong. Yes. I suppose we have to be. Would you say a few words, my lord? Do I get to choose? Father, he was everything, everything I ever wanted to be. He showed me what it is to be a lord. He was so brave, I never knew a better man. I 
than I am. I am sorry. I love you, father. Ethan, my little brother. He stood up to Ramsay Snow. He saved our sister's life and paid with his own. He was only a boy. We honor Lord Gregor Forrester, my husband, my love, and our Lord Ethan, my sweet little boy. This is a sad, sad moment. But now is time to say goodbye. Father and son are returned to the earth, to the ice. And from their sacrifice, new life begins. Iron from ice. Iron, Iron from ice. ice. This is... This is sad right here. I thought Ethan was going to be here until the end of the game. Really, it cuts out the, her music. If I had to know Tall Tale, the episode. Sucks that it cuts out her music, though. She's washing the blood. She washed the knife as well. This game has me interested. It didn't have me hooked like the last game I played. Uh, the last Tall Tale game I played, uh, Borderlands. It, it doesn't got, this game doesn't have me hooked, it just got, it's got me interested. That, it, that's all it's got me. I want to get to the episode where I murder the son of a bitch that killed Ethan and the son of a bitch that tried to disrespect me. Oh, he's got that look in his eye. Oh, oh god, he's gonna murder that man. I swear to you guys, I'm going to chop that fat ass's head off and shove it up his ass. Is that the end, or are we just switching characters? Because I'm pretty sure it's the end. Next time on Game of Thrones. What is going on? Roderick, you have to do something. Lord Whitehill's son has arrived. Griff Whitehill means to torment us. Nothing worse than a fourth-born with something to prove. Oh. It was bad enough when God. it was just the soldiers. We can't live with them under our roof. Form up and follow my lead. You'll be taking your vows. You too, Tuttle. Time to start proving you're a brother. Oh, the things we do for family. I wonder sometimes if it's worth it. All the sacrifices. Enjoy the wedding.
How much further to Marine? A few days. If the Lost Legion doesn't catch up to us first. No. I overheard a couple of men whispering about the Lannister Guard. They're questioning people. Is there anything else we need to be worried about? What was that? Oh God. That doesn't sound right. Didn't forge the notes. Refused to kiss the ring. Lost the bro to Elena. Shit. Stood up for Cutter after he stole Finn's knife. No shit, I'm gonna stand up for the son of a bitch. You killed Mira's. Who won't attack Mira's attack? Uh, kill Mira's attacker. Fucking, he was about to kill the only person that I trust in this fucking game. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.